Great grind day, great grind day. Welcome to your vitamin G conversations with Kendall. I promise you, like this was probably the dopest thing I ever heard in my, in my life. Um, it, when I used to have my shop, uh, and y'all probably heard me say this before, I used to wake up just to go to work, right? And there'd be times after a hangover, because I was a straight alcoholic, after a night out drinking, you know, just being real frivolous with my life and frivolous with my time, I would get into the shop and it would be, it would be late, mad late. I'm texting cats all the way there like, yo, I'm running late. And I'm talking about I'm backed up. I might have five or six appointments backed up. Just really, just, just real reckless with my clients, with my business and with my life. And I got to the shop one day and one of the OGs that I used to cut, he said something to me that really, really helped me and really changed my life. And I want to share it with you, right? So I walked in the shop and you know almost kind of hung over right and um he was like and i was like man, late late and he was like he was like uh kendall like what's going on like you okay and i was like yeah man you know it was one of them nights and he was like yo like you you gotta stop oversleeping and under hustling i was like what whoa what you say he said stop oversleeping and under hustling i was like bro i just oversleep yeah but you oversleeping and you're under hustling you got money in here that's waiting for you. Like, let's just, I'm looking at this on the base level because I was hustling. I'm cutting hair. I'm in a cash business, right? And I'm losing, I'm losing, I'm, I'm losing. I might go and get the cut and make some money, but I'm losing credibility. I'm losing the respect of my clients and I'm losing because there's other barbers in the shop. And if I ain't there, they could potentially go sit in another chair. So I'm losing, first of all. And some of y'all are losing. You don't see it leaving out of your hand, but you losing. So my man was like, Stop oversleeping and under hustling. And what that really means is you average, Kendall. You being average. And because I was being average, my business started dropping off. People started going to other barbers and I started losing it. And now, so look, here's what I'm saying to you. The reason why you can be replaced is because you oversleeping and under hustling. You might not be physically oversleeping, but you oversleeping and under hustling. You living your life, you playing the game average and everybody that's average can be traded. I'm gonna say that again. Everybody that's average can be traded. Kobe Bryant wasn't never traded. LeBron James don't get traded. Everybody else on the squad get traded except the best that's on the squad. And when and they don't oversleep and under hustle. And so what I'm saying to you is, if you wanna make the most, right? You wanna be great, right? You wanna be phenomenal. You gotta stop oversleeping and under hustling and you gotta stop being average because they keep the best. Even if you at your company, if you the best at what you do, they are gonna keep you around. If you average, you can be replaced. If you average, you can be let go. They don't need average people because everybody can be average. I say this all the time. Only 5% of the American population make $100,000 a year. Only 5% of the American population make $100,000 a year, right? So if only 5% make it, that means there's 95% of the population that's average. So if you want to make that $100,000 a year, you can't be average. Stop overthinking and under hustling. Y'all have a great grind day. We'll talk soon.